tournament here, do you feel like the pressure is more on Sweden going in on this tournament as favorites and then playing against you guys tomorrow? Um, yeah, I think so. Um, because they also said they want to go far in the tournament. Um, and we said we wanted to reach the quarterfinals. So if you look at that, I think the pressure is with them. Um, but I think we're also... Um, yeah, putting a little bit. We 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 also put some pressure on ourselves because we feel we can we can do something. And maybe a little bit, but it's only our second uh, tournament yet. So I understand that people are underestimating us a bit, but uh, we're just very happy that we showed what we're capable of as a, as a, as Belgium being. So um, yeah, that's. You said it was your second. Um, I think it shows um, that we have a lot of potential. We have a lot, a lot of very good uh, players, also uh, very young, talented players. So I hope um, more and more players of them can uh, become professional. And then I think you haven't seen the best yet. More questions? Might not be playing, and I, I know you're a fan. Can you say anything about the impact she might have had on the game? I think uh, she's just a very experienced player um, in the, like the controlling midfielder role. Uh, I think she has more than 200 caps already, uh, so she's been uh, through a lot. And uh, I think um, in all kind of situations in the game, people will listen to her and she she will give advice to everyone. So I um, yeah I didn't know she wasn't might be able to play. So uh, we'll see tomorrow uh, tomorrow. And the Swedish defense, what's your view on them? Um, they have um, very strong uh, defensive players. Uh, they're also good with the ball. Um, so, um, yeah, we will uh, we will try to, to make it hard for them in, um, in our own style of play. Yeah. What do you think about that? And do you think you've revealed a little bit too much? It's... Uh for me, not a point. Uh, it's it's his idea to to say what he wants. Uh, okay, uh, I know what we're gonna do tomorrow, and that's for me the most important. What do you think about the fact that he has gotten information about your team from media? <laughs> yeah, okay. I don't know the the information, so uh, okay. Um, I'm uh, I. I, I I'm not. I'm not uh, afraid of, of information uh, who, who's go to the other side of the teams. It's it's football. It's a it's a quarter final of a European Championship. Uh, I think it uh, shows maybe a little bit nervous, nervosity nervosity of, of uh, the other side. But uh, for me, I don't see any problem. Regarding also the fact that Sweden has uh, two confirmed COVID cases, how does that? affect your style tomorrow or your game plan that you've already set up? Uh, it will not uh, change very much because uh, like uh, your colleague uh, said, uh, we play against a very strong team with 23 uh, good uh, players. So uh, I think also uh, when someone, maybe because I don't know it, uh, will play in, uh, in the team of Sweden, uh, they they start with a very strong. They will start with a very strong team. Okay, next lady there. Yeah, that's also uh, when we talk about individual qualities. Uh, then we have also the experience, um, and uh, uh, that player uh, with all her experience, uh, I think every coach uh, will have a player like her uh, in the team.
Anthony Targas, Sam Akipa. Laatste man. Oké. Okay. I'll give you the uh, I'll send you the link. Ça va. Okay. 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 Okay